How's it going, YouTube? It's RJ here, and this is going to be a pretty long video. Now, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be kind of what I would consider, this is me doing as best as I can to, like, kind of stream, but, you know, to nobody whatsoever. So, what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be trying to get three different shinies, and I'm going to try to do it all within one take, and we'll see what we can do from here. Um, how this is going to work, because normally this is going to be my idea for a shiny race, which, if you guys are interested in doing a shiny race with me, please let me know in the comments section down below. And, basically, all it is, is you have to try to get either two out of three Pokemon, or you need to get the three Pokemon the fastest. Now there's three different methods we're going to be using for this. The first one is going to be fish chaining, second one is going to be uh, horde hunting, and then the final one is going to be in the friend safari. So depending on how the person I'm going to be working with wants to do it, it's going to be the fastest person to get all three shinies wins the shiny race, or the person who gets best two out of three wins. So if the one person gets a fish chain Pokemon first and then I get the Horde Hunting second, then the winner would be determined by who gets the Friend Safari Pokemon first. Now that all the rules are kind of established, let's just get into it. Um, if I fail, it's gonna be okay. I'm playing some type of like remix music in the back if you want to listen to that. And it depends, I don't know if you guys want to listen to this music or if you guys want to listen to the game audio. Because personally, I would like to listen to the game audio by myself, but, you know, it's up to you guys. I'm actually going to go get my earbuds real quick, so that way I can listen to the game audio, so that way I can just listen to the, um, whatchamacallit, the little, sim the, like, symbol, sim uh, not symbol, the, the little audio cue that tells you, hey, um, you got a Pokemon on the hook. That took forever for some reason, I don't know why. And we're just gonna run away. So currently, I'm hunting for a Dratini. Which is pretty awesome. I like Dratini a lot. And I know that we have a huge chance of catching... Carvana. Oh my god, please Dratini be a shiny. I like this remix right here, this one. I remember this one. I remember the like original. Hopefully none of this music is copyrighted. So we are on a chain of three currently. And that's a... Uh, what the heck is that Pokemon? Basculin. I hate Basculin. That's why we run away. So I think that Coca-Cola should go sponsor me through these long videos because let's just say I, I have to survive off of only Coca-Cola products here at my college. So two Dratinis within, within four, that's crazy actually. Because I never find Dratinis and I bet the shiny is going to be a freaking bar bas it's a basketball. Why do I want to say Barbarical? Because Barbarical is a cool Pokemon. I hate his design. But I used the crap out of him in battle. Oh, I hate masculine. Oh no, I didn't bring a ghost type Pokemon. Wait, does this one have final gambit? No, the um level 51 has final gambit. So guys, um, I'm extremely excited for Pokemon Sun and Moon, Holly World. That's a, it's going to be what it looks like a really good game. Even though the demo was kind of like upsetting for me, because I didn't, I didn't get to keep my rock rough, and it made me cry a little on the inside. But um, the demo was okay. It was definitely not what. I consider good by Pokemon standard for the Pokemon Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire demo. 
because that was a really, really good demo. But, um, yeah, I'm really excited for the game. I'm going to Shiny Hunt for Rowlet, even though I prefer to go get Litten. I want to have to do Rowlet for my first Shiny for soft resetting. Which I'm okay with. Rowlet isn't that bad of a Shiny. I just don't like the Pokemon necessarily. Well, I just don't like the Sidueye. So what copy of the game are you guys going to be getting first? Because I personally am thinking about Sun. But I'm not exactly sure. Now, the typing on Sogalio actually surprised me because, you know, it was a sun, so I thought, hey, it's going to be a fire type, which is pretty cool. We don't have that many fire type legendaries, which is probably a lie. Entei, Moltres, Mag... Oh, what is Heatran, Heatran, not Magmar, what am I thinking? But yeah, we... I don't know, is that it? For fire type? There has to be more. There really has to be more, I don't even know. Now the worst part about me being here at college is the fact that I can't connect to the internet for my DS. And that sucks. Because I can't go claim a lot of things, I can't go do battles like I want to do, I can't can't do a lot. Just trying to fix the screen. Seven minutes in and we're, you know, doing pretty well. Um, hopefully, I'll have to find, like, a good, you know, sound, like, for the background music if you want that. Another stupid basculine that nobody likes. So that means my friend safaris I'm going to go into, they're only going to have two Pokemon in there. Which is going to be, eh. I hopefully will be able to get everything done within four hours, but... Who knows. Um... I'm trying to go on to... I was about to put Rap God on it. I don't think I could play that without, you know, getting in some type of trouble legally. I don't want to have any copyrighted music, so I'm trying to stay away from that, but you know. Hopefully the next time that I do this type of thing, it's going to be with other people. So that way, I can have like a conversation, we can talk. Because I don't really know what to talk about, and I have nobody to talk to except for you guys. But if someone were to pass me in the hallway, and they were like, what the hell is this guy doing? He's talking like a weirdo. I'm going to have to be like, yeah, I apologize for that greatly, but you know. I am who I am. <clears throat> I don't know what number we are on the chain, but does it matter? No, if I could keep my, you know, my DS still, that would be perfectly fine. And centered. Mm. 
So, I don't expect everyone to stay till the end, but <coughs> if you guys could, that would be awesome. <coughs> Choking on an M&M here. With this amazing polywhirl, which is female, if I, if I had found that polywhirl and caught it, its name would be Bertha, definitely. Because Bertha is the name of all my polyworlds. <laughs> Male or female, I don't discriminate. It's going to be just Bertha. <laughs> I it's because I like the idea of having a poly toad <laughs> named Bertha. I don't know why. I am strange, but you know. Y you guys can deal with me or you guys could leave. Dun, 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 dun. So I opened up my first packs of evolutions and I have to say it was amazing to do. I got them from Jeff from the Poke Capital from their website and they were pretty cheap. I mean shipping Shipping was a little expensive, but you know, all in all, 10 packs from them was cheaper than buying 10 packs at the store, being said I can't even make it to a store. And I got them within three days, which was an, it was nice. So I plan to do like Pokemon battles once I get, you know, time to make them, time to actually battle. And there is a stupid Basculin. I swear, if I get a Basculin shiny, I'm going to be very upset because I dislike that Pokemon very much. Oh shit. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> okay, we can restart the chain. Chain of one. How did I mess up that badly? I was very, um, very fidgety. That would have, like, ruined me if I was in a shiny race. Because now I gotta get set back from one, and we were 13 minutes in. What was that? Like two drafts in seen overall? Dratini never liked me anyway. But don't worry, one day it will. Dum dum Mm. Mm. 
I'm actually surprised. There's, I believe there's like some type of like Pokemon club here at Rutgers, but I am the most antisocial person alive, so I haven't made friends here at all. Really, kind of. I mean, I have like friends, but I haven't personally. I haven't talked to anybody for about like two weeks, which you know isn't very healthy. You should probably start talking to people, Robert. But you know. I personally am not very sociable. But here we go with another fish encounter. I hate you, Basculin. I just don't want you here at all. You highly upset me. And that's highly upsetting that you highly upset me. I would like to join that Pokemon club and like, you know, use my deck to battle people, or my Pokemon to battle people, instead of, you know, not battling anyone. I do plan to do a giveaway at the very beginning of um, December, and, and I'll end it on Christmas Day. It's going to be another Christmas giveaway, but this time it's going to be a pretty big one, actually. Um, I'm not going to spoil it, but I've been collecting the Pokemon all year, and it's been kind of, kind of tedious, kind of a little difficult, but, you know, I manage. I'm going to get a shiny Politoed that's competitive. I'm going to breed one, because I really want one. I have my own shiny Politoed, and I already have my... I'm sorry, I just, like, stopped there. This is, like, the third or fourth, like, Red Battle remix. Give me some, like, Route 1 music from Pokemon and Red. I gotta find my Game Boy char Charger, so that way I can charge up my Game Boys and then shiny hunt on them again. But they're at my mom's house, which... I guess I could still call home, but you know, I don't live there anymore. I live here, inside of a dorm, all by myself with a roommate who's not here currently and probably won't be here until like tomorrow. He goes MIA a lot. Oh, why aren't you pink, you stupid blue Pokemon? Like, I love Shiny Politoed's coloring. I, I don't like Poliwag, Poliwhirl, Polyrass. Just the light blue. That's not that's not cool. Come on, Pokemon. But I know they had no control over the Shiny Sprites for a very long time. I think it was up until X and Y when they had control over the Shiny Sprites. Which, I'm not going to lie, some of the Shinies actually ended up turning out pretty darn good, even though they were accidental. Let's say Charizard, for example, but I don't know how he goes from gold to black. Let's see, what is this one? No, I can't, I can't have this one play. Why I can't? Let's see, uh... Let's have that one play. Is that a shiny? I don't think so, I didn't hear a sparkle. Yeah, I can't be playing some copyrighted music. I, I don't make enough money at all. It wouldn't even matter if I had it copyrighted or not, in all honesty. It's just, I don't want to go through the hassle. And I would like to monetize my videos, because 
I, I will one day make the amount of money I need. So that way I can consider myself a good YouTuber. That way I can be like, huh, all you people who are like, you need to stop and actually like do something else. You can be like, huh, look at me. Rolling in that YouTube money, which will never happen. <laughs> it won't happen for a very long time at least. I am pretty proud that I do have 700 subscribers when I never expected to be anything higher than 25. So it makes me happy. So we're 21 minutes in pretty much right now. No shiny, but that's kind of my fault because I was like, let me just press A for no for no apparent reason. Ghastly. Is it just me or like whenever you hear a Pokemon's like screech or noise, I always try to like put the name of that Pokemon in it. I really do need a capture card. Uh, maybe I'll maybe I'll just like be like, hey, 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 family who loves me ever so dearly that you never see me anymore. You should go give me a three hundred dollar device for Christmas and for my birthday. It will be my Christmas and birthday gift, and that way I can actually record without having it go blurry. Because I know you guys notice it. I notice it. Whenever, like, the screen goes from black to color, it takes a second for it to adjust, which, I mean, by all means, it's still better quality than a lot of my other... It's better quality than I think I could have done a while ago. I think my quality for, like, the game has gotten better just because I have a 2DS instead of a 3DS. Because 3DS made it so difficult. I'm not even gonna lie, it really made it very difficult. But yeah, we're, we're just fishing. Going for a pink Dratini, which... It's been a while since I've started up the hunt for it again. If I catch any more Poliwhirls, I'm gonna have to start giving it the same Baskin treatment. Because in my, um, Tiny Bassulin videos, they just keep getting the, keep editing the thumbnail. It's the same picture, it's just that it's edited several times over and over and over again. And I make it more demonic, the Bassulin, just because it keeps trolling me, it keeps appearing light green when all I want is just a pink. Dratini. Honestly, if I get that Dratini today, I would freak out. I'm sorry I cussed too earlier. I don't really want to cuss a lot. It's not, it's like this is a child game. It's not, it's not really appropriate to cuss per se, but you know, I, I, I'm a person who is an adult. I can cuss. But I'm going to... I want to play, like, Call of Duty video games and... Well, zombies, per se. Technically. And, like, Black Ops 2 and Black Ops 3, even though I can't play Black Ops 3. I have a PlayStation 2 right now, which can play Black Ops 2. I can do that game, but... I don't have any... I don't talk to people. I need people. I need friends. You, you, you guys want to be my friends? 24 minutes in, and I'm asking you guys to be my friends. You guys want to be my friends? Oh my gosh, play well. Like, like, I do that for all the Pokemon. I don't know why. Except for Pikachu now, because Pikachu does it all by itself. Guys, that Lavender Town remix, Hollywhirl. 
Dragon Ball C. Gotta hear Vegeta. Another polywall. I do plan to do my tutorials for certain, um, like, shiny methods soon, but not right now because that's that's going to be saved for another time. I already did Masuda method, I believe. Yeah, Masuda method and uh, what other one? What other one? I think I did fish chaining. I think I did my fish chaining part two, which I've done two fish chaining tutorials, and fish chaining isn't even. This shading isn't even hard at all. In all honesty, I probably could have had a shiny by now if I did not mess up. Okay, some of the, like, some of the newer ones, I can barely put names to it. Like, the Malamar sound, the Malamar screech, that is definitely not a, um, doesn't sound like Malamar. But, like, Gasly. <laughs> I don't know why, but it sounds like Gasly to me. I was wondering if I should open up the thing that allows you guys to donate money. Because I was I was going on my YouTube channel just trying to like fix everything, trying to make everything a little bit nicer, have all my things updated. I I also like changed my profile picture for the month of October, but doing that I also found a thing where I could set up an option for subscribers to donate to me or some some weird thing like that and I don't know how I feel about it honestly I'm not sure whatsoever how I feel about it because I don't really want I don't want your guys's money but I also want to have like the option available it's the same thing with the fan mail thing I want the option to be available I just don't necessarily like say hey give me your money I'm not like that I don't want you guys to like give me your money but I want you guys to have the option because there's people out there who enjoy my content a lot. I okay, and we got a shiny basculin. Okay, wow, what was that? 28 minutes in. So um, let's see. Can I do this? Can you guys? Can you guys see that? Yeah. Um, what I didn't tell you guys are right inside the thumbnail or the thing for this video. I'm actually going to be, let's see, I'm going to send out Carnivore. I'm going to be giving away some TCG codes throughout this. So throughout the whole thing, I'll be giving out some TCG codes. Trace, what is it? Reckless. Oh, please, please be nice. Aquatail. So I'm going to Thunder Wave, which now has a 90% accuracy and only makes you 50% slower. What was that? Brian? No, it wasn't Brian, was it? Uh -huh. We'll use a dust ball. Ah, oh, come on. You better stay paralyzed. I really didn't think about a way to like lower the HP on these Pokemon.
Okay, don't, don't, don't say captured. So, okay, yeah, that was the name of the move. Turns you into a water type. Why couldn't I think of the name? Let's see, do I have anything? I have a semi-poor level 52. What? Let me check the moves. Um, I have cut, waterfall, lick. I can do lick, probably. I'll lick it once. <laughs> I'll lick that dirty fish. Just try to lower the damage. I mean, lower the HP. Let me, let me lick you a little. Let me lick you a few more times. Um, I hope I didn't like show the code too early. I don't want this video for people to like hunt down the codes. And just take one, please. If you can, just please take one. Ooh, hiccup, sorry about that. Oh, don't I don't have time for ads. Especially not Yokai Watch. What are you? You're no Pokemon. I feel like it has it has takedown, I remember, I remember this Pokemon has takedown or some stupid like self injuring move. And I caught it! Oh my god, was it out of focus the whole time? I swear, it better not have been out of focus the whole time. I swear, was it out of focus? I bet it was. Oh my god, if it was, I'm going to I'm going to beat myself up over it. I think it was once I put the code in, it went out of focus. Uh, we're gonna nickname him Green Devil. I'm really sorry about that, if it was out of focus. It... I can't see my screen. I swear, it probably was so out of focus. Oh my good not- oh my good god. <sighs> Well, anyway, we did capture it, um, if you guys honestly cared too much about it being in focus, which, I mean, that is my fault, it needs to stay in focus, but look at that. Look at that. Let me, let me use my stylus, not the one that comes with the DS, because I forgot where that belongs now. But look at him. It's pretty nice. I knew he had a self-harming move, you stupid, stupid Pokemon. So, yeah, that's... Basculin. So that's one third of our little hunting escapade. Um, let's see, can we s switch? Show off this Basculin real quick, which might actually not work because he's paralyzed. Yeah, he's paralyzed, so it won't, you know, show up. But yeah, that was Basculin. We're going to go find a new place to go and, let's see, hunt. So now we're going to fly, um, let's see, I, where is the half hangout for wild and directionless youth? Uh, what is this one? It's a well-known fishing spot. I don't, I want, like, a place where I can, oh, not that place, not that place, definitely. Okay, focus, cam for it. I think the reflection also might throw it off. I'm not sure. Uh, where do I want to hunt? Let's see. Right, right here will be good. So we'll fly here, and then we'll just go horde hunting now. The reason why I chose these three methods were just because of the fact that I kind of wanted them, um, kind of wanted easier methods, so that way these videos wouldn't be like days long. <laughs> it should take a few hours though. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Yes, I see you there, person trying to give me my mythical Pokemon. I do not want them yet. Okay, 
um, we're going to put our shiny basculin inside of a shiny box. Um, pretty sure there's one that has 15,000 basculins in it. I do believe I traded a few away just because I really do not like the Pokemon. But yeah, there. See, like I have that one was a sassy reckless, but yeah, I have plenty of these guys. I don't, I don't need any more. So now we're going to be using Sweet Scent. So let me go get my Sweet Center, who I believe is. These are some of my Wonder Trade hack Pokemon. Some of them. I, I don't know exactly which ones are mine or which ones are not mine. But um, I feel. I'm trying to think which one which one of my Pokemon is Bell Awesome? Yeah, Bell Awesome. Is Bell Awesome is a real shiny. So we're going to put Malamar in the box. We're going to put Greninja in the box. We're going to put Townflame in the box. Because we don't need them anymore. Uh, actually, let's keep Malamar out just because I can use I have a smoke ball on it, and I don't really care to deal with it. And then, who is my nice, like my false white? You have who is false white? I swear, I have one Pokemon that does that. And I promise the quality of my videos will be getting better. I just kicked my camcorder. I don't care. We we don't need anything right here. These Pokemon are low enough level level for me to perfectly fine and I can't move it's really difficult looking through the screen like my camcorder so we're just going to be horse hunting now um Oh, and if it's a nose pass, I'm going to be really sad. Focus. Okay, so now I have it angled in a way where I can actually see it as well. The screen. I wish there was like some type of way we can um like just use sweet scent automatically. But now I don't need these earbuds in because I don't need to listen for the, um, ooh, Yanma. I don't need to listen for the, which one called the, um, the fishing rod. I do, I would like to listen for, like, the shiny sound because, you know, sometimes it does not appear at all, which is a little frightening, I'm not gonna lie. Nose pass. Oh my gosh, if I can get a shiny nose pass, it's actually gonna that's gonna make me cry. I don't wanna cry. At all. Why, why would I want a shiny nose pass? So I'm not necessarily keeping a count of... That's why I am keeping a count of it. So this is number four. Oh, please, camcorder, focus. I don't understand why you are not focusing. Here, does this help? That might help. None of them were shiny, right? Yeah. That might help. I had a light on, but I don't think that light helped whatsoever. I think it actually just made it worse having the light on. Yes, it made it worse. The light made it worse. So turning off the light like I just did helps out so, 
so much more. I know better than to do that too. I knew way too much better to, than to do that. So we're at five. The only reason why I even had the light on was just so that way I could show off that code. Which I probably should have done like after the shiny, like midway through this. So that way the people can't like just skip to where the shiny is. Oh wait, now there's a code there too. Oh look what I just did. I'm just gonna skip through the whole video and find the codes, which I don't know, I don't like selfish people like that. But like I said, if I don't put the word code giveaway inside the title, then nobody's going to even know. This is number seven, I think. Yeah, no shiny on this. I'm going to put my earbuds back in so that way I can hear for a shiny, which is very helpful. In all honesty, I don't know why I used the calculator to count how many I've done because it really messes me up. I, I just don't remember how much. Oh, these ugly nose passes. I mean, Shiny Nose Pass is not bad. I'm not gonna lie. He's not bad. It's just that I already have him and then I caught him again and I evolved one of the Probo Pass. Uh, what did I name mine? I think I named one Mario, but someone was... Oh my gosh, let me talk to you guys about this. In one of my comment sections inside my most viewed video, it's the Friend Safari Shiny Tutorial. Someone kept commenting, see look, I already messed up, I don't even know what number we're at anymore, I'm gonna just give up on the calculator. But someone kept commenting about the fact that I, that video was completely wrong, that shiny charm doesn't affect it, that is blah 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 blah, why am I using Illuminate? And it was like, dude, first of all, this video is like years old, back when we didn't have the data and we still thought that shiny charm had maybe some role in it that going online could have affected some of the odds. Okay, camcorder, why don't you focus? Oh, uh, I... That's, that's why I really want to get a capture card. It, with my YouTube money, um, if I ever make it, like if I ever earn the amount of money that I need to actually have get my money from YouTube, I, the first thing I'm going to buy, I'm going to save that money up for the capture card because I feel like it should go towards it. All, all these ugly nose passes, none of them are yellow. Honestly, if a yellow one did appear, then that would have been wonderful, but you know. But you know, I don't want this video to be the longest thing ever, but it definitely might have a chance of being pretty long. What's the other one? Uh, Electric. Electric is here. Or is it Houndor? It's one or the other. Depends on the version you have too, I think. I think it's version dependent. So I don't remember which one was which because if I'm going to be honest with you guys, I haven't been playing X and Y or as often lately just because college work and the fact that this is not my full-time job like some other YouTubers. I would love for this to be my full-time job. Hell, I would. If this was my full-time job, I'd do it every day because I enjoy this, but I just don't have time.
Oh, uh, maybe I should have gone inside the ice cave and gone for, like, vanilla light. Because I haven't had that one shiny. But getting a shiny Yamna, or Yamna, however you pronounce it, that's a nice shiny, too. It's blue instead of red. But getting another shiny nose pass would not be fun. <sighs> Why don't you focus, Cam Porter? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Because that right there, I see this screen, and it looks very, very good. Like, for what I see, like, I can fix it and make it better. But, for what it is, it's really good. It's just that, from fading from black into color, it causes it to go so out of focus, and it really irritates me. Because it messes up a lot of my videos. And that's why I, I really am going to try my hardest to keep uploading, make that $100 threshold, and then get myself a capture card. So that way I can give you guys the best quality, because, I don't know, I kind of like you guys, you know? I think, I think you guys deserve good quality videos instead of, you know, regular quality videos. Average quality, I would say, because this is not bad quality, per se. I mean, I haven't seen the shiny masculine where it pops up inside the video because I haven't finished it. But this is like me going live through it. I'm not going to pause it. But, um, who knows? I'm definitely going to keep this at least stopped at four hours. I'm not going to have this longer than four hours. Because um, that's going to be a little too long, in my opinion. Just if it's a solo single video. But I feel like if I feel like I could get the shiny within that time. Using these ugly blossoms. I kid, I love blossom. This one was given to me. I won this in like a giveaway from an old friend on YouTube, which I don't think she does Pokemon anymore. But um I got it from her, and it's a legitimate one. However, I also call myself a legitimate gloom, which I'm definitely going to evolve into a Bell Awesome because I really don't like Vileplume Shiny. However, I think that Vileplume is a much better competitive Pokemon than Bloom. I mean Vileplume. I mean that Bell Awesome, I can't speak English. I can't speak what's on my mind. We have not seen any other Pokemon except for Nosepass and Yam though. Yam no. Of course it is the rare Pokemon. Uploading this video should be fun. It's probably going to take hours. I think that's what I'll do. I'm just going to give away codes whenever I find a shiny. And speak of how I haven't found any other Pokemon except for Nosepass and Yamna. So it is Houndoom. I, I mean Houndor. I think a shiny Houndor would be pretty cool, especially with Mega Houndoom. But I can do, I can do without Houndor, because I really would like the shiny Yanma. I just don't like Nose Pass. I don't want a shiny Nose Pass, but I know the odds are I'm going to get myself a shiny Nose Pass, which isn't cool. I'm getting either Houndor or Yanma. That would be cool. I'm hyped for those two. I don't know what to say. Am I boring? Probably. Not a good entertainer for some reason right now. Maybe it's because I had no idea what I wanted to do coming into this video besides, hey, 
I'm going to shiny hunt for a very long time, and I'm just going to record all of it, even if I mess up, which you guys can see at the very beginning. I could have taken 20 minutes off, the, 10 minutes off this video easily, or 20, whatever it was, and I'd still have pretty much the same content, same quality. But if I had stopped it, I probably would have said something or missed out on saying something earlier. I don't know. What are you guys doing in the beginning, sun or moon? I don't. I I think I'm getting sun. Because I like Sogalia. But I also really like... Like, here's the thing. I probably would have picked Moon. First of all, it wasn't for the fact that it's a lion. I like the lion. But the thing is... I don't think that, um... Moon Nala's... What it looks like. It looks like Evil Talk, in a way. And it's not, like, original. <laughs> it's not original. Why is there another Evil Talk? Psychic ghost type evil talk. Psychic. Oh my god, I forgot about that typing too. That's a terrible typing. It's not the first one to have that typing because Hoopa. But we all know Hoopa isn't the most competitive. Unbound Hoopa, that's a dark psychic, which is much better. And gets rid of the fighting type weakness. He gets rid of the ghost type weakness too. Um, he gets rid of the dark type weakness and makes it all neutral. All these Yan monks, Yan monks. The thing I don't like about horde hunting is the fact that you can't see all the Pokemon. And that's kind of that's like, uh, I kind of want to see them all, but you know, what if I don't see them all? Probably gonna start like breeding again for competitive shinies. I do understand that most of the competitive shinies that you guys see are fake. Mine, on the other hand, are not because once I learned how to do it and how to breed well, all my shinies are legitimate and all my shiny competitive Pokemon are legitimate. And the thing is, if I get the shiny Pokemon and it's not competitive, I'll stop right there, um, well, not stop, I'll s Cause normally I get the competitive Pokemon before I get the shiny competitive one. And sometimes, like, I do get the competitive one normally before I get the shiny. Cause I usually, I'm like, okay, I wanna get this Pokemon both competitive and shiny. So I go and breed for a shiny competitive one, I usually get a 5 IV or 6 IV one. And I use that one because I breed, I breed a lot. <laughs> and then I use Masuda method with a um, Japanese Ditto and try to get as competitive as possible. But I get my competitive Pokemon legally first, and then with the Japanese Ditto, and then my shiny. There was one time when I got a shiny competitive Heracross six IV, and that was the coolest thing in my life. Like, I, I never thought to get a perfect hair across. I mean, who, who gets perfect hair across? Not me. Well, I mean, I did. Who, but how rare is it to get a legitimate 6 IV shiny Pokemon? That was... I, I, I don't think any of my other Pokemon are as cool as that. I mean... Don't mess with my Sylveon, and don't mess with Riley. But I don't think anything is as, like, awesome as being like, Hey, look, I got this, and it's legitimate. But yes, I do understand that a lot of the, um, shiny Pokemon you see on Battle Spot are fake. But, um, if you ever see me on Battle Spot and you see me using shiny Pokemon, which is rare, I rarely use shiny Pokemon unless they're competitive shiny Pokemon, which I don't really get a lot of. I was wondering why it was out of focus. Oh, please go back into focus. Hound doors? Hound doors that are out of focus? What is this? Oh my god, that's terrible. And it's good. I need this capture card, like, ASAP. 
peace out. Cause I want more for you guys. I want it, bye. I am using Shiny Charm too, which shh, don't tell the Shiny Hunting community because they get really upset whenever someone's using methods that are harder. Because if it's not full lab shiny, then you know people flip their me their effing mind. I don't. If it's there, I'm gonna use it. I mean, I have games where I can full full lab hunt. And I have done it before, so, I mean, it's definitely much more rewarding if you do it full odds, but don't crucify people if they're using fish chaining or pokey radar or anything like that, because it's a tool inside the game. It's a method inside the game that was implemented by the company itself, so you can take advantage of it. However, there are certain games where if I, I just wouldn't. You see, if I was Miss Alice, I definitely could not go so long without getting that shiny mud kit. And I feel so bad for her. Sorry. Sorry, Kayla. Sorry. You gotta, you gotta get that shiny mud kit. Guys, watch that PSA video again. That was, I think that was my best video I've made on YouTube. Best video. I put a lot of effort into it. Um, if you listen to it, it says that I had someone working with me. Um, at the time I recorded the outro, I kind of said the person's name after, and I did the outro first. Yes, I did the very last thing first because I knew what I wanted to say. But um, the person I quoted as in helping me he wasn't able to help me actually i ended up doing everything by myself all the editing all the camera work everything by myself which it was difficult i'm not gonna lie it took a lot of time and i'm really proud of it i'm not gonna go now the person who was supposed to help me he had reasons why he couldn't help me but um i wasn't gonna like completely changed the outro just because of that, because I knew that if he was able to help me, he definitely would. But college, <laughs> college is busy, college is very busy. All these nose passes. All these nose passes. Nobody likes a nose pass. The second I get internet connection, I'm going to make a battle using a very, very powerful underrated Pokemon. And then I'm going to hit up Furless, and I'm going to be like, hey, put this on Fan Friday, because it needs to go there. You can't trash talk this Pokemon anymore, Furless. Hey, we're nearing an hour into recording, which isn't bad. We already have our shiny from Fish Chaining, which... Unfortunately, it was that bastard Basculin. Bastard Basculin. We, we should use... I'm going to use that now. That's going to be my new name for Basculin. Bastard, bastard Basculin. I'm probably going to forget. And it's going to go back to being just the friggin' devil. I legitimately have like five or six videos on Basculin. I don't know why. And this is going to be another one, but this is going to be longer. Um, I don't even know what friggin' um, what place I'm going to even hunt for the friend safari. I definitely don't have as many friends on the 3DS. Ooh, hiccup. 
after birth. I don't know what it was. I do want to do more collaborations with people because, like I said before, I need friends. I need a lot of friends because I'm not good at making friends. And the people I know here, they don't necessarily like Pokemon the way I like Pokemon. They don't have the um, games or anything. They have, they have Go, which is okay, I guess. I don't necessarily play Go competitively. I haven't battled any gyms except for one at like a Chili's I was at, which I was like level 5 then and the game was out for like two months and everybody else was so high level and I was like, what's the point? I kind of like bumped the camp. How unprofessional of me that I bumped the camera. I'm a terrible person. I'm uploading this is going to be a nightmare. The one hour video plus. I don't even know. I don't even want to know how long it's going to take for it to upload, render, all that stuff. And right now it's almost one o'clock in the morning. But I have no roommate here, so I can talk loudly and not care. It's the weekend, everyone's at a party or something. I'm here playing Pokemon, and I'll be here all the time. I don't know how this video is going to be now that you don't hear the sound of the Pokemon game, that you just hear this background music. Which I hope isn't bad or anything. It should be okay. Oh my god, that was fast. Run away from those passes. I don't know how long it takes for me to get a horde shiny. Normally it's not too long. Like it. I usually get them by random. I don't ever like shiny hunt, horde hunt. I use horde hunting for like my training for EVs. But um, this right here, horde hunting. For shinies, it's much different. I'm trying to center this. I don't even know why I keep knocking it out of like out of like being centered. There we go. One hour and three minutes in. I don't think it rains on this route. be so cool to have it would legitimately be cool to have a capture card because if it is what i think it is it's just the regular 3ds with like another port or something to hook it up to the computer or something like that. i don't even know but i could film and be able to actually hold the ds in my hands 
And that's like, that's ten times better than doing this right here. Because it's not in my hands, it's not in the normal playing mode, it's legitimately I'm just there. Look, I, it's on my desk right now. You know, I'm sitting like a foot away from it using my stylus. But a lot of the, um, a lot of like the buttons and stuff like that and what I have to do, it's kind of like memorized now, so I don't normally mess up on most things because I have it, I have almost like photographic memory of what I want done. Like, the motions, how I can just press X, click on where I need to click on for the hidden TMM, or X, X, A, then click on the, um, sweet scent, which I can automatically just do from, because I know which one it is, or just by hitting that button, and then the sweet scent. It's like, inside my head. I really do want to get, like, a shiny. If I could get this, like, under two hours, like, under three hours, that would be cool. I would really be happy if I could get it under three hours. And I'm going to try uploading it tonight. I don't even know these remix songs in all honesty, I just put it on YouTube. It was like, Pokemon remix songs, no copyright. Because I'm unoriginal. I, I do wish I had people to talk to. I would like to make Pokemon friends on YouTube with some of the like popular ones, which is hard to do, because I don't stick to one thing, because I play the video game and card game, don't watch the TV show, so you can't, you can't, I can't do everything, well, I mean, could watch the TV show, I just opt not to, probably, it probably isn't bad, but it's still, like, So I'd rather watch Gotham. I need season three on Netflix to happen ASAP because I finished season one and two within three days because I was like, let me just binge watch this stuff and not sleep for a very, very long time. I don't remember the exact odds for shiny hunting for Horde Method. Like, it's I, like how many you should go through for it. I can probably do the math right now. Um, let's see. One third of one out of four thousand. Some is I don't even know. I'd have to Google it, and I'd have to use my phone for that. But my phone is playing your music for you guys, so I can't necessarily do that. Unless I, like, stop the music, but then you guys wouldn't have any background, and that would suck. Unless I took out, like, the ed ear ear ed uh, earbuds or headphone jack or whatever, whatever it's called. Nose packs. Steven Remix. Well, 
Hoenn Champion Remix. Uh, Glitch X City makes this stuff. That's where most of this stuff has been coming from. So, Glitch X City, shout out if I get copyrighted, and then I would just contact you, I guess. But, you know, you have 179,000 subscribers. I have, and 730, no, it's... Heck. He could remove the amount of subscribers I have and still not be at 178,000. I am a small channel, which is why getting in contact with bigger YouTubers is pretty hard. And like, wanting to do something with a bigger YouTuber would be extremely difficult. And most of the bigger YouTubers are the ones who do collaborations, and if they want to do a collab with me, with me eh, then they really won't gain from it. Necessary. I mean, they'll have another video, which honestly, that's that's a game in some way. But um, I mean, yes, there's a chance I might gain from it, but I don't necessarily. I don't want to collab with bigger YouTubers to do that. It's just that I like the personalities of some of them. Yeah, I'm uh, and I would like to like sh I would like to shiny hunt with some of them because. I've asked other YouTubers around my size if they want to do any collaborations, and of course I haven't heard anything from anyone. Which, you know, uh, 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 I'm kind of alone. Guys, I should put, I should put boobs in the thumbnail for, for views. That's a joke, guys. Yamba. What do you guys like more from my channel? Do you guys like the shiny hunting? Do you guys like the Pokemon cards? Or are you the other hundreds of people who come to my videos and ask me, hey, you should give me a code. Like, just give me a code. You know, being that you paid your $5 for a pack of Pokemon cards, you should give me a code that you spent money on. You should give it to me. Hey, can, can you give me codes? Can you give me your Pokemon cards? I want your Pokemon cards because I, I don't have many Pokemon cards, so you should just give me your Pokemon cards. I am not a big fan of that stuff. I am definitely not a big fan of that stuff. At all. I do giveaways. So, enter the giveaways that are going on, by the way, on the Dark Ride RCS giveaway. That Those codes that should... Actually, I should probably film that video after this and pick out a winner. I don't pick out a winner until, like, the day I upload the winner. But even then, when I pick out the winner... They don't ever contact me, and then I still have the prizes left over, and I don't give it to the second person, because usually they don't answer either. I mean, not air, it's air, most people do answer. For this Christmas one that I'm doing, the person better answer. Someone's going to be getting what I'm going to be giving what. But for, like, these codes, if not everybody gets it, then I'll just use them for myself. It would not hurt me in the slightest to use those codes for myself. I could always use another Arceus. Gosh darn, Kyogre is evil looking. This drawing of Kyogre, anyway, it is evil looking. I want to show it to you guys because it is scary. But I'm going to, I'm going to keep from destroying my camcorder's focus as much as possible. No fast. No fast. No fast. Mm-hmm. 
The last one. The reason why I chose this place is so that way I don't think it rains here. I mean, it might. Who knows? But, um, if it does rain here, then I'll just head to the ice cave. But we do have two more shiny Pokemon to go get, which... I'm not going to say it needs to hurry up. Like I said, I have a four-hour time limit that I set on myself. But, um... <laughs> that upload video is going to be crazy long. I first experimented with the ad system, too, in the um, first demo playthrough. And that was kind of fun. <laughs> I was like, oh, you have a longer than 10 minute video. You can put ads in between. I'm like, sweet. So then I was like, okay, let me just see how many I can add. And I was like, well, I added too many. I added enough. We don't need, we don't need uh, any more. <laughs> we definitely didn't need as many ads as I put on that one. Well, I'm not going to remove it because I find it funny for myself. Like, it's an inside joke for myself. I am just waiting for a shiny. I don't know if this is boring for you guys. I hope it's not boring. Can you guys see this? Now you guys can. Uh, focus, camcorder, focus. Focus, 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 focus. Okay. There you guys go. That's yours. Look, now you guys can be less bored. Two codes given away. Breakpoint, that is. Oh, I loved opening up that booster box. That was so awesome. I would like to open up another booster box, but, you know, I don't got... I don't have money, guys. I'm a college student. I'm living off of this ramen noodles. Actually... I do have money saved up for Pokemon Sun. I will be getting Pokemon Moon later than Sun, so I won't have them both at the same time. But, um, I will eventually get both. I get both of all of them. The only games I did not own ever were Ruby and uh, Platinum. And I lost my Pokemon Black version, which... I don't, I'm actually kind of like sad about that because I like black version. Even though I like Zekrom more, I, I definitely like Zekrom more. I don't know, does Sierra sell Pokemon games? Because if it doesn't, then I'm kind of screwed. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. If this Sears that it is by one of my is by my college if it doesn't sell pokemon sun or moon i will be very 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 screwed actually should i get moon because of the rock rough evolution i don't know i really don't know Hello, Houndor. It's nice for you to show your face. Unnerved. Making me unable to eat my snowball. Pity. Pity. Can't wait for Leech Life. When I saw that Leech Life had a huge, huge buff, that kind of made me really happy. I'm like, oh, cool. Buck type Pokemon can use a really, really strong move now. Bug type has some competitive viability now. I mean, they're always going to get screwed over by my fireball. Uh, let's see. Let's go with that one.
I mean, personally, I would like to listen to my own songs, but they're copyrighted. The Zombies YouTubers, I, I know they're having issues with Spaceland, which I don't have, actually. Um, I probably won't have infinite... I won't... As, not even up, probably. I won't have Infinite Warfare until Christmas, because um, I'm buying it for my stepfather, and so that way he can get the... um. Modern Warfare Remaster, but I will not have a chance to play Infinite Warfare until then. And I did not want to play it on the PlayStation. I do not want to play it on the PlayStation 2. PlayStation 2. I'm definitely playing it on the PlayStation because I don't like any of the other systems. Why can't you give me a blue yan, ma? I want a blue yan, ma. You guys see those animals? They're all red. Speed boost, Yan Mega. That's a cool Pokemon. I'm really working out a team right now just to go get on Verlis's Fan Friday. I would really like to be able to be like, hey, this Pokemon that you've been trashing for who knows how long? Yeah. I made it good. And it does work. It just takes a lot of setup. And I don't want to do any of those like, oh, let's go put Swords Dance, Speed Boost, Iron Defense, like all that type of like boosting and then use Baton Pass. Because I don't like that. I want it to set up all by itself. Like, of course there's going to be in, it's going to be in doubles, but I want there to be a support Pokemon for it, like, to help out. Other than, I don't, like, I don't want Smeargle. I really don't want Smeargle, because I don't like Smeargle. I think he's cheap. Personally. I mean, yeah, I mean, you can use, like, really weird ones, like, using a one-hit KO move, Smeargle, like, just have Sheer Cold, Fissure, uh, what's the other one? Guillotine, and then, I know there's, like, one more, I just can't remember it off the top on my head. Having those... I, actually, maybe that's it. But having that on a smear goal, that would be pretty fun. I would like to watch that. But I don't like the let's go put a scarf dark void in smear goal and then fake out dark void and then uh, baton bass with a... I don't even know. I don't like that. I, I would personally, like I said, if there was a one-hit KO type Smeargle, oh, I would love to watch a battle with that. I'm not going to say what the Pokemon is, but I do have, like, a planned partnership with a, um, with a certain grass Pokemon that would help out so much. But here's the thing, statuses are going to be difficult to deal with. I'm not going to lie, statuses are going to be a pain. Because if that Pokemon, another Pokemon gets status, I, I can't do anything. I won't be able to win. 
because the Pokemon requires to give a certain status to it. Like, I cannot burn, so I can't be using Scald, I can't be using uh, certain moves. I mean, Dark Void is a move I could use because sleep eventually goes away, and I do think sleep is a nice type of thing, but like I said, Dark Void is cheap. Which is why if you didn't see my Dark Void <laughs> Dark Fire videos where I trolled on people a little, uh, you guys should definitely hit. You guys should definitely watch those because that was funny. I I would use it to troll, but I don't use it seriously. If I was going to do a serious battle, I would never use Dark Rai. I would never use Dark Void. I would I would use certain Pokemon. I would use Regigigas. Regigigas is pretty darn awesome. I like him. Because what I did was, I did a skill swap. Sylveon, like, I did a skill swap. Sylveon, and then I got the um, slow start for Sylveon. Cut my attack in half, which I didn't need my physical attack. Cut my speed in half. It was a slow Pokemon already, it didn't really affect me too much. But, um. I'm going to figure out a way to make Truant work, like, to get rid of Truant. I mean, there's the, um, Mummy technique. Which I'm okay with. I would definitely, definitely like using the Mummy technique. And how that is, is you have the, um... You have mom. What's the name? Cofagrigus. Cofagrigus gets hit by a physical move, gets red carded, and then the other Pokemon, of course, gets mummy. And then you use Pursuit on Slaking, and then Slaking, because Pursuit, no matter what, is going to hit the Pokemon, and then you'll get mummy, and that way you'll have. At least a bit, an ability that won't negatively affect you. You'll just have essentially no ability. Which why do I keep moving that? Having no ability for slaking is much better than having truant. Uh, truant for what you call it for? What's the name of it? Durant. Durant is a pretty good truant Pokemon as well because it gives it has entrainment. Also, another Pokemon that I find very helpful with having Entrainment is Mega Audino. I run my Mega Audino with Entrainment because, hey, if I'm going to have a bad ability, I'm going to go give the bad ability to um, Mega Kangaskhan. Mega Kangaskhan cannot punch me twice anymore, and it will not be getting that free sword stand with a power-up punch, and anyway, the power-up punch would be neutral. And it won't really... Mega Kangaskhan really doesn't have much for fairy types. Like, return, yeah. But if you have a Mega Audino, it's... It's definitely not going to hurt me. However, my favorite Megas are definitely Mawile and Slowbro. Definitely those two. Do I believe Mawile belongs in Ubers? Heck no, because you put Mawile in Ubers, now it doesn't do anything. It does absolutely nothing in Ubers. I don't like Smogon, personally. Like, I don't like their, their rules. I will use the heck out of the program, though, because getting battles and just practicing and making up teams without having to do all this extra complicated work to see what works out for you, and then I use that to go put that into my own video game by breeding it specifically. You don't know how long it took to go breed for the Pikachu Cup thing too, but you better believe I got that Pikachu. And I did pretty well inside the Pikachu Cup as well, I think, personally. I did well. I think, I, uh, I don't even remember the team I used. What was it? It was... It was Electivire, Rotomo form. I 
think I used Pikachu. I think, I think, was that like even a, I think that was a necessity to use Pikachu or something like that. I had Mega Ampharos. I had Lantern. What was that six? Lantern, Electivire, Pikachu, Mot Rotom Mo, Mega Ampharos. And then one more Pokemon. I don't remember who it was. I don't believe it was, um... I don't believe it was a, um... Common one, either. Because I know Electros was used a lot. But that didn't bother me. What I was kind of, like, not okay with was just running into a Rotom wash form. So that's why I ran Rotom Mo instead. I used Pikachu of Dig, which was good. People weren't expecting that. I really want to remember what my Pikachu, my team was. I don't even, I don't remember at all. And it was like a good composition. To, I had a really good team for some reason. Oh, I, it was Mega Manectric. So I was running two different Megas. That just in case I didn't want to use one and I wanted to use the other. That's how that ended up working. Okay, I remember. Depending on if I wanted a good like, sweeper or not. Because I used it for lightning rod. And I used some for discharge. I used like a discharge into um like motor drive for Electivire. Made it extremely fast. And then I had it, it was Assault Vested 2, and I think it had an adamant nature, max attack, max speed, and it wrecked. Like, it did a really good job. Because it had Earthquake. The thing is, a lot of Electrovires were running Earthquake, but I'm not sure how many people were using Pikachu and it had Dig. I mean, using Earthquake while your Pikachu was buried underground, no matter what, killed your Pikachu. Unless you use a Focus Ash Pikachu, but let's let's face it. If you were using a Pikachu, you want to use that. You want to use that Light Ball. I love Light Ball. I love Light Ball Pikachu because how many Pokemon I just nuke with Volt Tackle. Breeding for a Pikachu competitive was super difficult. I mean, it was unbelievably difficult for no reason. It's been a while since we found that shiny, but I'm okay with that. I think Friend Safari, no matter what, is one out of 500 something, so we just gotta do 500 encounters in there. But the thing is, I know that with this, now that I, it's just the chances for shiny charm, it's the chances of shiny charm, but divided by five. I'm going to find out the actual odds so that way I can just remember it. So I hope you guys are okay without the music for just a little bit. But um, let me just type it in. Shiny, charm, odds. Do. Okay, I, I don't know what's happening now. Phone, get rid of it's an ad. So Shiny Charm makes it one out of 2,048. Yeah, I think 2,048. So 2,048 divided by 5. 1000. Okay, 2048 divided by 5. So we should go through like 409 encounters, like 409 of the um port encounters before we find a shiny. In normal odds. Which I believe we can get, make it. Blossom! 
Yanma. Our smoke ball Malamar. Trying to figure out how it can run away from five different Pokemon. Stupid Yanma! Nobody likes you. Is, is four hours too long? Personally, yeah, I feel like it's a long, long, long video. But, um... Hey. I'm uploading it. You don't have to watch the whole thing. Most people won't, definitely. Definitely. I honestly don't know a single person who watched the whole four hours all the way through. Which, does that make it pointless? Maybe. Maybe. I'm not gonna lie. But, hey, it's, it's out there for you guys if you guys just want to watch the whole thing through. I want a shiny. I'm impatient now. Imagine doing this with a full odds. Full odds shiny hunt like this. Like, pretend, like, someone did, like, a 24 hour stream. Or, like, 48 hour thing. And they did that. That would be so. It would be cool. But they would have to have nothing else to do, like, they, it would have to be their job, first of all, or during the summer, or during a break, when they have time to set up for a 24-hour stream type thing. Just making sure the music would be heard. Pretty sure you guys can hear it. Hour and 37 minutes, 38 minutes, almost there it is, 38 minutes into the video. It's a long video, I think this is probably the longest video I've uploaded. Definitely longer than, I, it is my longest video, I'm not going to say it's probably, it is the longest video I've uploaded, because the one before, the longest beforehand was the uh, Pokey Radar tutorial, which, my god, that was terrible. I was like, I just ended up cutting a whole crap load of clips together. But, um, it worked. I showed everything. It wasn't necessarily the best video. But I ended up getting that shiny fur fro. First try. I, like, I didn't even restart after I said, hey, I'm going to attempt this. This is like, that was my first attempt, and I was really happy. I'm going I plan to redo it soon. Probably this weekend, like, probably tomorrow, I'm going to go for the tutorial on, uh, Pokey Radar, which is by far, it's the hardest method, I'm not gonna lie, it's the hardest, it's the quickest, one of the quick, like, you know for sure you have a shiny, this is a 100% guaranteed method to make sure you get a shiny and you know when you walk into a grass with a shiny Pokemon in it. However, getting to that, you have to go through 40 Pokemon, or less if you're lucky. But you have to go through a lot. And I would like to do it so that way it was 40 Pokemon straight too. Because I don't... I would love to get lucky and get the shiny Pokemon on like, chain number 25, but... Going all the way through to 40, I think, would be the best video. Because it shows you, hey, this is your max, this is your best chances of getting a shiny.
Would this be a good place to poke the radar? Maybe. Maybe. I don't particularly like it, but it would be a good place to poke the radar. And once again, the screen wants to mess up and not, you know, focus whenever a Pokemon appears, but thank god it wasn't shiny. I really do think I messed up the video with the shiny... Uh, what's the name of that Pokemon? Basculin. I do think I messed up where I got shiny Basculin once I showed that code. Because having the light on really did make a difference. Not a good difference either. <sighs> I am going to get a capture card. I can promise you guys that. Yanma. I am tired of you, Yanma. Malamar is a weird Pokemon, too. I'm not even going to lie. It is a freaky Pokemon. I mean, just look at it. When it pops up, how it splits the top, like, splits for the leg. That's so freaky, too. I can't. It's weird. Yanma. Look at it. Because that used to be at the top of its head. Now it's its feet. I'm not going to lie, guys. I'm a little tired. <laughs> it's 1.30 at night. Filming Pokemon, but I'd do it for you guys. I swear, one day I'll be entertaining. That's a Houndor group. I know you could definitely tell because the good quality of this stupid video. <laughs> That's a group of Houndor after like 15,000. I hope that um, Sun and Moon has a good ending post game. Kind of like Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. Like, that was cool with Zinnia. And what was it? A Aster. Aster was the name of the Whistler. Because I remember I named the shiny um, Whistler after that. With our luck too, the shiny, the legendaries are going to be shiny a lot. And I know it's going to be shiny, it's more than likely going to be shiny a lot, I'm not going to lie. For the last how many games they were? Which sucks. I mean, why would they make the shiny birds unlike, how, why would they make them not legendary? Like, not shiny. Why would they make the legendary birds not legendary? Good, good one, RJ. Good one. Blossom. You're the best, Blossom. Okay, it was focused, and then it decided to go out of focus. I understand your methods. I understand your methods, camcorder. You just want to mess with me. Well, guess what? 
I have a thick skull. You know, nothing's messing with me. You guys want to be my friends? <laughs> I, I legitimately would like to like have a Skype call and do this with other YouTubers. Um, I do plan to do this with Ms. Alice. It's just that we have to wait until she gets Sun and Moon and then she does a um, Shiny Hunt through there because she wants to do some normal odds before she goes back to Shiny Charm. Which I do understand completely. So until then I'm gonna have to wait. But I just wanna upload this so that way it gives the idea to other YouTubers who are interested in doing this with me. Nose pass. I need to get the Genesec code. I don't have it yet. And that saddens me. I have all of them stored up too. Like, I legitimately have every single last legendary stored up. Because if you walk into the Pokemon Center, the Pokemon's like right, the lady, she's like right there, she's like, hey, I got your Pokemon. I'm like, I have to tell her no all the time. Because I want to keep all my legendaries and then get them all at one time. So that would be a cool video. I'm not going to lie. That's like, hey, all the, from you all the way to, uh, dumb. <laughs> to, uh, what's, what would be the last one? I don't have Volcanion, actually. I missed that event, which actually really irritated me, because I really wanted to get Volcanion, so I don't have a Volcanion yet. I hope to get one soon. If anyone wants to give me a Volcanion, I will greatly take it away from you, and I will keep it in good care. And I'll tell her I love it every day. And my... Hmm. Let me take another swig of my soda so that way I can stay energized. Coca-Cola, you should sponsor me once again. I, I tweeted at Coca-Cola too. I said, you guys should sponsor me. So I can have ad revenue. They never responded. So I guess they're still like deciding whether or not they should or not. But hey, at least they're deciding. Oh my god, Yanma. Why why aren't you blue for me? The reason why I say the um I don't know why I did this one first, like, why I did this. Yeah, I keep getting shiny whispers whenever I forward encounter when I don't do it on purpose, because I, I usually go there for the speed for Zubats, but I get forward encounters for HP all the time with Whismur, which for my bulky Pokemon I'm okay with. Okay, so one of these Yanmas have Frisk, but what about Speed Boost? I would like to see if one of them had Speed Boost. Because you can get hidden ability ones from... Horde Hunting. It's just rare. Nose pass. Pass. Not nose pass. Nose pass. That's P A S. Not P A S T. Learn your English, RJ. Someone has told me in person, they're like, so, 
why do you name your channel after you, but still refer to yourself as RJ? And I'm like, hey, don't, 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 don't challenge me with that question, because I don't have an answer. I don't know why I call myself RJ when my channel name is just Robert Kenzel. Is Kenzel, however you want to pronounce it, is German. Someone from Germany can correct me all they want. It's an awesome YouTube channel name, you know, Robert Kenzel. Not very original. For the longest time, too, I kept searching my name onto YouTube, and then it kept popping up with some baby. And I was like, okay, so some baby with over a thousand views has more has has more to their name than me on YouTube. And I was like, uh uh. Now, whenever you search up Robert Kinzel, it's someone who traded with me. Well, actually, the very first one is my channel, but. After that, it's just people who've traded with me, and then after that, it's my videos. So if you have your name Robert Kenzel in your title, then you get found quicker than, than my actual channel. We're getting close to two hours. So that means we haven't found a shiny in a very long time. Thank God it's not a shiny nose pass. <laughs> not gonna lie, I don't really want another one. I would like a shiny barbarical. I have one, I think. I think I have one. But I would like a shiny barbarical. That's competitive. Because I like competitive barbarical Shell smash with folk sash into anything. And you get your kills. Razor shell is the best. But um, of course, you know, you got that chance to miss. With stone edge, you still got a chance to miss. There's a lot of chances to miss. And it needs physical contact. Uh, I have cross chop on it too. I think it has cross chop. I don't even remember my set. One day I'll have to, like, do a video showing off all my competitive Pokemon. All of them bred by me or fought by me, too. Because I have a lot of good legendary competitive ones. Just because of the fact that in these games are 3 IV, so you can just soft reset for a good one. And I'm probably going to soft reset my Pokemon Y game. Just so that way I can get a competitive evil tall. Because getting a competitive evil tall would be pretty darn awesome, I'm not gonna lie. Modest nature or timid nature? Probably. I don't know. I... Like, I could go modest so that way I could get all the um, boost from Oblivion Wing. Probably would go modest, but timid's not bad either, but I, I would still probably go modest. Why are you not blue? You know the one competitive Pokemon I don't have, like, finish? I have, like, six Garchomp. But none of them are completed. Yes, I don't know what I'm doing with them. I had it written down to what I wanted for each one. Certain ones to be, one of them to be a mega. Some of them to be beyond like tankier one with the rocky helmet, and then some of them being your you know physical sweepers. But I did not know what I wanted to do with it because I don't think Garchomp is the good Pokemon, necessarily. I mean, yeah, it's powerful, but I'd choose almost any other of the Dragon types over it, because I know what I want to do with the other ones. And let's just say that, like, for example, 
my um, Hydreigon. I love Hydreigon. It is possibly my... I think... Okay, it's not I think. Hydreigon is my favorite Dragon type one. Like, my favorite... Well, not only is it my favorite Dragon type, but it's my favorite um, pseudo-legendary. And with its... T it's one of the only special attacking ones where you use it for a special attack. You don't have, like, a mixed guard comp. You don't have, like, a mixed Salamance or a Salamance. Salamance is supposed to be physical. Dragonite is supposed to be physical. I mean, yeah, it has decent special attack, but it's meant for physical attacks. Now you have a, um... Hydreigon. Hydreigon is meant for special attacking. It can use its Dragon Pulse. It can use... Um, Earth Power can use Dark Pulse, it can use Flash Cannon, it can use... Uh, does it get Sludge Bomb? It gets a lot of special moves, and it has a lot of variety. I mean, yeah, my Sylveon kills it with, like, a Tackle. This Pixelated Tackle kills, if you guys didn't know. But, um, I mean, that's only on... That Fighting Dark type, what's his name? Scrafty or Scraggy? If you have a competitive Scraggy, good for you. But my pixelated tackle is going to kill you. But who doesn't run like an assault vest Scrafty? I'll tell you who I don't. Because I use some really weird, I have some really weird move sets because I don't like playing conventional. It's not fun for me. I don't use regular moves or anything like that. I like to come up with weirder sets. Because if you saw from like my competitive guides that I've done prior, they aren't really what people normally run on those Pokemon. I mean, yeah, I do have certain conventional sets, but even then, for my Talon Flame that I have that's competitive, I have Steel Wing on it. I don't know why I have Steel Wing, but I have it. I mean, what's it going to attack super effectively? Like, Rock type, Ice type... Rock type, actually. Yeah, that's probably decent, but even then, it still isn't doing much. The attack is abysmal. Won't be the only, which got nerfed, which I'm okay with. I didn't like Talonflame too competitively, necessarily. Because you could Brave Bird, then Roost. Brave Bird, Roost. I myself am a huge fan of Meganium, or Meganium. Meganium is a really cool Pokemon. It was actually, it was, it was, um, I know Meganium and Mega Manectric. Those were my first two competitive Pokemon. I'll show it to you. I'm actually thinking about it. I'm going to be making a video showing off all my competitive Pokemon and then, like, reviewing the sets for them. Because all of them are legitimate. I don't use Pokemon that are not mine. Well, not legitimate. Like, I have some of them that I've gotten from trades that I just keep around, but I don't use them. Like, I have a Blissey named Predagirl. I've used, like, a few t I've used a few times in, like, the Battle Mansion, but I don't necessarily like Blissey. I like Chansey more than Blissey. Because of Eviolite. I'm letting you guys know throughout all of this fog on the screen. There is no shiny. I'm gonna let you guys know, I don't listen to this stuff normally, like this Pokemon remix stuff. But I felt like it was appropriate. Two hours. Two hours, guys. And no shiny, except for that masculine. I don't know. I think 
think after I get this shiny from horde hunting, I'll be done. Because I have another two hours that I promised you guys, but it's late. <laughs> it's very late. I'm tired. But I will get this horde shiny for you at least. And then, what the next step will be, or would be, and I'm probably gonna say this again for those who catch, skip to the part where I find the shiny. I'm, it's a, um, I don't even remember what I was talking about, but, um, I'll be heading to a friend safari, and since I don't have anybody online, I haven't seen anybody online, then I will only have two Pokemon I go through, and then I'll just keep going until I get the shiny from the friend safari. Oh, these nose pads! Like, this is supposed to be like a quick method, but for some reason I am getting no luck with this one. I would like to stream, but you know, I don't have a I don't have a laptop that can do that. I have a Chromebook guys, um it's quality, it's like top of the line quality. Oh my god, I hate it so badly. The Chromebook is so stupid. I can't do anything. I can't download Pokemon Go I mean um Pokemon TCG. TCGO. That's why I have all these extra codes that I don't really want to give away, but I'll give away a few. Because I can't use them right now. It upsets me. And I can't download my screen recorder. So all my planned Pokemon Showdown videos, all gone. I mean, I can record it, but the thing is, if I want to put a face cam in it, I can't, and I would like to do, if I'm going to do the Pokemon Showdown and I can actually put a face cam in it, that would be awesome. It would really be cool. I'm not going to lie, I would love to do a face cam Pokemon Showdown, like, team building series, and then team build with a face cam. <laughs> kind of like, um, like, what's his name? Why am I drinking out Shady? Shady Penguin. Good YouTuber. Really good YouTuber. He seems like a really good guy. Good guy Shady. Good guy Gersh. <laughs> and I also did plan to make like Black Ops videos, but you know. That kind of didn't happen because I barely got views. Oh my call hit booty once. So we're we're kinda just gonna stay to Pokemon, but I mean this is my channel. It is my channel. That Pokemon is my channel. It wasn't supposed to be my channel. I, I expressed to myself, I specifically said I will not let myself make my channel about Pokemon. But then I um saw some guy and he did, I'm not going to say his name, well, I can't, uh, the Untitled Game Show, he's kind of the reason why my channel is how it is, because he did his own team, and I was like, okay, I'll make a team, and then I threw together a whole crap load of Pokemon that weren't very good, because I wasn't good at battling, and I was like, hey, can you help, like, like, grade my team and tell me what's up with it, and he's like, well, first of all, this is wrong, and this is wrong, because I had, like, a sandstorm team, like, a sandstorm team, I mean, I won the battle that I showed him, but the thing was, I was using a flamethrower graveler, uh, Flanders that wasn't good, I didn't know anything about anything, <laughs> and he was like, well, you should probably use this and that, and I was like, okay, okay, I was nodding along, when I was reading what he was telling me, and then he, uh, I didn't understand a single thing he was saying. Now, I can tell you almost anything about Pokemon. I, I made it my channel. After I uploaded that video, 
my channel became Pokemon, and I was like, okay, this is what I set out to do. Then I did my shiny hunting. I like started shiny hunting. I was like, okay, this is cool. Let me go try it. First shiny I ever saw was the Zubat in Fire Whip, but I didn't know what it was. So I just thought my game was turned dark, and I was like, I am tired of Zubat, so I just ran away from it. And then the second shiny, because I just thought it was my game getting dark. The shiny that I knew was a shiny, but I didn't know what it was, was a shiny Geodude in Pokemon Diamond. And I used that game for hours, and I've never seen a shiny before. And then it was a golden Geodude, and I was like, oh my god, what is this thing? Did my game just glitch or anything? I didn't have a phone to Google or anything like that. And I'm like, okay, what do I do? I don't know what to do. I think I thought my game was glitched. So I was like, okay, I'm just going to run away from it, and it's not going to bother me. Well, it bothers me now that I did it, that I ran away from it, because that was a shiny Geodude back from Diamond and Pearl. That's 4th Gen, right? Yeah, 4th Gen. A 4th Gen shiny. That's so cool that I found that. I mean, I ran away, yeah. And then I eventually learned what a shiny was afterwards. It didn't bother me until, I, until, until like, I started shiny hunting, did it bother me? But then I saw the first shiny Pokemon I actually ever caught was a shiny Garbodor. And I have that in this game right now, so it doesn't have the blue pentagon, because I found it in 5th gen. I was like, oh my god, this is a shiny Pokemon. Let me go capture it. So I caught myself a shiny goat Garbodor. And I'm really happy about it. It's a beautiful shiny. I'm not gonna lie. It's a beautiful shiny. I don't know why everyone hates Garbodor. Oh, it's a trash Pokemon. Ugh. Pokemon ran out of ideas. Ugh. Shut up. That's my shiny Garbodor. You don't talk about my Garbodor. I love... That's a, it was, it's a beautiful shiny. In my opinion, gray and blue my favorite shiny. People say it's an ugly Pokemon, but personally, I think Basculin's an ugly Pokemon. Basculin and Octillery. Ugly Pokemon. Ugliest Pokemon. Shiny Octillery. Regular Octillery and Remoraid, I'm okay with the Shiny Octillery and Shiny Remoraid, I hate. I, I hate with a passion. And not like, real hate. I mean, Basculin, yeah, I real hate that one. Shiny Octillery, it's really ugly, but I fake hate it because for some reason one of my most viewed videos is me evolving a Remoraid, a Shiny Remoraid, into Shiny Octillery. I don't understand why it's one of the most viewed videos on my channel because I have much better content than me evolving a Pokemon. But yet, for some reason, an ugly looking artillery. So, and me saying, I hate you, I hate you, you hate heading it like this, it ends up being one of my most viewed videos. And it smacks me too. I hate it. I hate it. I love it to death. I hate it. Absolutely hate it. That reminds me of one of my friends. Like, when I started, her name was Kathy. I don't know if she watches my channel anymore, or even anything like that. But, um... I found her online, from playing the actual Pokemon game. And then I got my- I got a, um, shiny Chespin. And a... Another shiny for her. A shiny Squirrelix. A shiny Squirrelix. I got both of them for her. And we had a good friendship too, right? I just don't know where we haven't talked in a while because she kinda stopped doing Pokemon. And if she was still doing Pokemon and we just had time to talk, we would probably still do it. Because she was a cool person.
as I kick the stupid tripod again. Let me just adjust the DS instead of the tripod. But yeah, after I get the shiny from board hunting, I'm going to be done because I, I gotta sleep. And I, I, I'm going to start the upload tonight because it probably won't, it will take a while. Now I'll make a nice thumbnail, uh, I'll click beat it, put boobs in the thumbnail. It'll be a nice thumbnail. Hopefully it's not a nose pass, because it is a shiny bastion and a shiny nose pass for 2 hours and 11 minutes and 13, 14, 15, 16 seconds of hunting. Yeah, that's a, that's a sad, sad waste of... 2 hours and 11 minutes and 23, 24, 25, 26, 27 seconds. 28 now. After. Jesus. I am tired. <laughs> good thing I bought these sodas before I started. I need the energy, guys. I need I need the caffeine. I need, I need a sellout. Give me some G fuel. I need a sellout. I don't know why I need this out. Selling out isn't the nicest thing. I don't know how many times I've seen Houndor, but it really does not seem like enough. It legitimately is probably, like, I've seen it maybe at most ten times. I think one of, like, a challenge would be the blindfolded fish caning. That would be cool. Because I think I'd do it. I'd be able to do it. Easily. First, I'd have to get to the spot, but you know, after that, I'd be good. Please, with that smoke ball. So, I stayed up on election night. I'm 18 years old, I could vote. And, in all honesty, I am not com- I'm not- I don't know what to think. I'm not gonna say who I voted for. I'm not gonna say that either way, if either Donald or Hillary won, I would have been worried because I don't particularly like them as characters. But I stayed up all night with that election. And I was just looking at Twitter and Facebook and I was cracking my ass off. Looking at how many people were like losing their mind. I don't think I don't think Trump can do anything to hurt, necessarily. I'm not saying he's a good guy. I'm saying he's definitely not a good person. He's a businessman. But, um... Politically-wise, he does he's a president. He doesn't have totalitarian power. This is not a dictatorship. 
there's no way he can stop. He can deport every single last person. I don't think there's going to be a wall. And Mexico sure as hell won't pay for it. <laughs> but politics aren't my thing. What I'm saying, what I said was, hey, as long as Pokemon Sun and Moon come out on the correct day and I can get my copy of them, I'm not worried about who the hell the president is. <laughs> But it doesn't affect me. I'm in college for those years. It's not going to do anything that will hurt me unless he raises the price of ramen and M&M's. Houndors. Hi, Houndors. Unnerve. I know it has flash fire, right? I don't remember. I don't look into... I have a Houndoom. A Mega Houndoom. I think. I think I have one. I don't remember. I don't remember all the Pokemon I have. And my Normally while I do this, I'd watch the YouTube video, like a watch of YouTube video, but since I knew this was going to be a long video, I had the music play for you guys, and I'm just listening to my DS, because I don't want to have both the DS and the music on and distract you guys, even though I know... It won't distract you guys. Run away! Run away, run away, run away. But yeah, I have legitimately six Garchomps. I'm trying to figure out what I want wanted with them. Because some of them I wanted like the sand veil, like invasion type thing, which would have been fun. Because I had bright powder and the sand, sandstorm and evasion. If that minimized, I would crack up. I don't know why certain Pokemon that are minimized Pokemon are so worrisome when a lot of Pokemon can become minimized Pokemon. And just missing Pokemon in any chance. Like, I would, I hate how smoke on, like, you can't do evasion, you can't, you can't have evasion moves, you can't have, um, you can't, like, baton pass more than once or something like that. You have that stupid, sleep clause is stupid. That is so stupid. It's really, really dumb. It's a mechanic inside the game itself. Why are you trying to remove it? So I mean Smogon. I would not get along with them. Necessarily. Like, I don't have a problem with them. You can go do what you want to do. It's just that don't catch me. Thinking, you don't catch, you will never catch me being like, Oh yeah, you can't use that because, because it's cheap or something. I mean, yeah, I don't like Dark Void, but use it all you want. It's cheap as hell, but go ahead, use it. I'll find some way to beat it, and if I can't beat it, then you won. Paraflinch, that's kind of cheap, but it works. It's a mechanic in the game. It's a Stogakiss's um, niche. I wouldn't do if you get rid of it, then it wouldn't be good for Togekiss. I thought one was shiny for a second. I was gonna cry. I really do not want a shiny nose pass.
And here's the cool thing, with a shiny race, it's essentially double the odds, because now you have two DS's going at once. So you cut that one out of like 500 down to one out of 250. Someone's eventually going to get that shiny first. It just depends on who it is. That's why I really like the idea of the shiny race thing. And no matter what, we'd go into like the third round, even if the, fir the person gets the first two. I mean, yeah, it happens so well. They've already won, but it would be cool. It, I wouldn't just like give up right then and there. Oh my gosh. It's 2.21. With 48 minutes, 29 minutes, 50 minutes. Seconds. Seconds. What am I talking about? Minutes aren't that fast. I'm thinking about doing Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. The, um new one but you see the thing is I want to do it like a let's play type thing but nobody ever watches my let's plays and that makes me sad it really does like not feel good whenever you put a lot of effort into certain videos and the ones that you put the most amount of effort into don't get watched, but the ones that you put minimal effort into and you snap the word giveaway on it get 100 views easily. I don't like that, necessarily. I mean... Okay. Yeah. Watch, watch the ones I put a lot of effort into. The ones that are better. The ones that I put 2 hours and 23 minutes and 13 seconds into. Watch those type of videos. Like, my my um, PSA, the skit, I put 36 hours straight into that video. I did not stop from when I started. And I got that video done all by myself. Because I really was into it. It was a passion project, not a um, 10 second video. And I have not even close, to, I don't even think it's 100 views yet. Which, okay, fine. I understand it. It's not something everyone will watch. But the thing is, the people who have watched it, I have gotten nothing but positive remarks from it. Well, except for like, okay, maybe the music was a little loud here, or um, other things like that, but, you know. People who don't even like Pokemon, that some of my friends that don't even like Pokemon, who watched it, they enjoyed it. Even if they didn't understand it. I hope the shiny comes soon. I need to take a nap. But our day, it's a, it's a Friday night. You're at college, have a party. Heck no. Heck no. Do you understand how difficult it is for someone like me to want to party? Especially when you don't know anybody? And you haven't made any friends? It's very, very, very difficult. Oh, I'm at 753 subscribers. Which is cool. I'm gonna go to my about page. Look at my views, you know. 54,000 views, that's pretty awesome. That's pretty dope. 
Pretty dope. Oh my god, nobody likes you nose pass. Like, my most popular video is a um, shiny Friends of Hari shiny tutorial which has 6.9 thousand views. What the heck? Six point nine thousand. That is a lot. I don't know why so many. I mean, in that video, I I called a shiny nose pass, and it was my second shiny nose pass on the channel. But even that, that surprises me that so many people have watched that video. Second. Most viewed video on um, Pokemon giveaway, Diancy. Uh, it was a Diancy giveaway, and then a shiny Gengar, and then the Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire demo, which was that was a cool giveaway too. Um, 3.2k. Then we flipped that number around, and we have 2.3k for how to capture competitive legendaries, which. By all means, I think it was a good video. Um, and then we have what I was talking about. Shiny Remoraid evolves into Octillery. 1 minute and 53 seconds and 2,000 views on it for no reason whatsoever. I legitimately do not understand why it has so many views. But then we had the live shiny, we have shiny tutorial, Poke Radar, plus, um... Plus a um, live shiny fur fro. And yeah, this is a live shiny patch. Why did I write such a long title? Should I just say shiny Pokemon shiny tutorial Pokey Radar Live Shiny Fur Fro or something like that. I don't even know. Then we have 1.6 view K 1.6k views shiny Audino plus Mega Evolution. So I call the shiny Audino inside of a friend safari. Then we have a live shiny shiny Baneri from Masuda Method. Then a live shiny Torchic from Masuda Method. Put all in the evolution or the mega evolution. Then that was our last a thousand view video. Then we have some Pokemon Rumble World. I don't know why my Rumble World actually got views like that. Because normally my Rumble World, I didn't think it would. I thought it was going to be similar to the, um, similar to the, um, what can I call it? My playthroughs and stuff. But then, um, the next one is Rumble World Legendary Part 1, Reggie Steel. Then Part 13, which is Rayquaza in a Diancy event. And event code giveaway. Yes, of course the giveaways. And then I think if then we have my Pokemon toy collection from an auction, which was I'm just going through my thing. Uh, it was a, coll a collection from an auction that I that someone won for me, and then I they gave it to me. And it was nice. It looks a crap ton of toys too, and they were pretty awesome. But then we have a um. Shiny Pokemon Shiny Hunting Tutorial Masuda Method, which was uploaded five months ago and has three, 630 views, which is pretty good. I, like I said, I was trying to revamp that series. Then we have Shiny Rhydon Evolution. Then we have Pokemon Shuffle Latios Level 50 and Mega Latios. I got a lot of views. And then we have an Egg Move Tutorial with Orraz Dev, the Devnav. Is that the name of it? Is that really the name of it? Dev Map? Yeah. And we have a shiny, live shiny, well not live shiny ditto, shiny ditto. Then my, a trade binder. Shiny Ryolu. Pokemon Rumble World. A giveaway, giveaway, giveaway. Shiny tutorial for GTS, which is, which is fun. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, shiny giveaway, giveaway. Trade binder. Trade binder. Uh, Rumble. Rumble. Giveaway. A competitive build for Dawn Fan. Shiny Petalil. Giveaway. 
Rumble giveaway. Uh, Mega Gardevoir Sweep, which Mega Gardevoir is one of my favorite legend, like favorite Pokemon. <laughs> well, Gardevoir in general. Uh, Rumble, Shiny Fletchender, Live Shiny Snivy, with only 187 views. That was my 200 subscribers special. What are you talking about? Only 187 views. Then um, another giveaway, giveaway, Rumble World, competitive build, card opening, competitive build for Sylveon, the beast. Then Live Shiny Charmander, uh, my deck build actually for Mega Gardevoir, a trade binder, trade binder, giveaway, giveaway. This one I'm actually surprised. 160 views on Pokemon Pokeball Easter Egg Tutorial. Uh, 500 subscriber special part one. Then a competitive build for Lucario. Then Trade Binder, Trade Binder, competitive build for Flygon. I like Flygon. Uh. Then we have two, a Trade Binder giveaway, Rumble World giveaway, giveaway, Pokemon Toy. So, so from the vast majority of it, a lot of it's giveaways. My higher viewed videos are giveaways, but they only have like 100 views, so even then it's not like the most thing. I'm just trying to... I had, like, some videos for, um, what is the name of it, the Pikachu Cup? I want to see if I can find it. Yeah, I got a Pikachu Cup guide, um, I had a Pikachu Cup team guide, which I showed off my team, I believe. A Pikachu Cup breeding giveaway, which I don't think a lot of people entered. And then um, a Pikachu Cup competitive analysis, like how I like what Pokemon are there, what you'd be seeing. That was essentially what that video was. But um, I was proud of that Pikachu Cup because I I did well. Um, Pokemon Picross, I gotta go do that still. But, um, I'm waiting for all the pick rights. I got one Super Smash Brother horror video just to show all the spikes with Pokemon. One Pokemon Go video with quotations. Should be in quotations. Wasn't. Should be. But, um, that was fun ish to make. But that was just to say, hey, I don't do Pokemon Go videos, even if you guys want it. I couldn't at the time. I would like to have. I got two Call of Duty videos, which I don't think a lot of people watch. I have one DC Legion of Collectors box, which I do have another one. I'm going to open that up eventually. I have a lot of Pokemon giveaways. 30 videos for that. I have 98 Pokemon card openings. Pokemon X and Y, I have 183 videos. And the first one being my Sandstorm team. And then the next one being a vertical video. Really, really proud of that. Really proud of that vertical camera, RJ. Ugh. Video started getting better at Shiny Ivysaur, Friend Safari, by better, it was in vertical. Some of my, my older hunts right here, like a, sh got a Shiny Psyduck cord, I got a Shiny, I got a Shiny Mary, which, I really do like Mary. I like that Shiny, um, I'm trying to see, I'm just, just looking through my old videos. 
I'm not gonna watch any because they're cringeworthy. Shiny Snowrun and Shiny Mawile. Oh my gosh, I love Shiny Mawile. I'm so happy to get that. You don't even know. I did my first, like, giveaway, too. It was a Shiny Eevee. I was like, okay, for 20 subscribers, I'll give away this. And then I ended up hitting my 20 subscribers. And, um, then I did a lot of, um... Fish Chaining and Friend Safari Pokemon, so like a Shiny Sea King, Shiny... Shiny Clarys, we're just gonna say that because Alamalamola... Alomamola. Alomamola. I know that's how you're pronouncing it, but you know. It's, his name is Clarys, we're not gonna lie. Oh, hey Houndor, I haven't seen you in about an hour. Then, um... I ended up catching, like, a lot of shinies in one day. I gotta find out when that happened. So my very first time I was able to actually do thumbnails was with a shiny Duosion capture. And then I stopped doing thumbnails because I couldn't care less because pe I, I, people just weren't watching my videos. So I was like, okay. But then I started like getting cooler ones, so Shiny Nose Pass Friend Safari. Hate that Pokemon absolutely so much. Shiny Golurk, I like Shiny Golurk. Um 6-0 sweep with a Shiny Kyogre. Hacked obviously. But um wasn't me who hacked it. I just picked it up somewhere. I don't know how. Best best photo editing job too, by the way. It was <sighs> I don't even know. <sighs> I want to show you guys real quick. I, I like look. I don't know if you guys can see that, but he's riding on a like stock footage image of a wave. Uh, six ID Chikorita bread. Um, that was when I was shiny hunting for a shiny Chikorita, and that took months. I'm not gonna lie, that took months. However, it was a pretty awesome, pretty, very awesome shiny battle. I'm just looking at, um, I'm just looking at videos that... I remember how I still have the passion for them. I really enjoyed making them. Any shiny in there, Yamna? No, Yamna. No, Yamna. Oh, I, I, I remember how I was. Remember how I was talking about how shiny masculine was the bane of my existence. Let me count how many. That's four. I got four shiny basculin before I even got a Chikorita. Well, that's five basculin at least. Six. So six basculin. Um. Pretty sure there might be more. In all honesty. Oh, I got a shiny, I had a shiny, um, shiny no pass and a horde with no shiny charm, actually, which is pretty cool. Can't get it now, when I'm looking for a shiny. Did I have a playlist for the hunt for a shiny? I don't think I ever made a playlist for it, but... I think in all in all, I ended up with six or seven. Less, I think six. Was it? I think it was six. Shiny Basculin. I don't know why. I also have six shiny Poliwhirls. But not a single. Not, not even one. 
shiny, um, you know, Dratini. I have a shiny Tepig after three eggs in Masuda Method. We're almost three hours in, and I've only gotten one shiny. I tried offering a new series, but people weren't, you know, watching that video. Competitive Volcarona, I remember making that. That was a pain in the butt. I shiny mudkip. How come I haven't made a thumbnail for that? I need a thumbnail for that. Like, I, I think I should like go back and make some thumbnails and redo some thumbnails that need to be done. Cause thumbnails definitely improve your videos, 100%. I'm not gonna lie, it really improves your videos. Like, chances of people watching them. My card collection grew. I remember when I had um the Gold Star Charizard. I traded it away. It wasn't in good condition at all, but it was really okay. It was really good. I liked it. I don't know why I haven't found a shiny. Ugh. I need a shiny Pokemon, come on. Probably should have brought one of my mats. Kind of stopped doing trades as well because they ended up being much harder to do. Oh, the music stopped, I'm sorry. I apologize. You were just listening to me talking. I bet that was boring. I was just reminiscing and not paying attention to... I don't know, either the game or... I don't know, I was just reminiscing. Come on guys, get pumped. Get pumped to this dubstep remix music. Yeah. By Glitch X City, they make a lot. Hey, thank you, Glitch X City. I'll, I'll leave a link down to Glitch X City in the description. I mean, they didn't come up with all the music in this video, but the vast majority, yeah. Get pumped, guys, get pumped. Oh, look at all those nose pass. I'm trying to think. Should I worry about my sleep and my safety over you guys? Heck no. You guys are more important. <laughs> That's a joke. I am in no danger whatsoever. But yeah, I probably should think about my sleep, but like I said, it's a weekend. I don't care. At all. I just want a shiny. <laughs> I just want a shiny. That's all I want. That's all I want. Don't want to waste like an hour of your guys' time with nothing happening. That would be terrible. I just uploaded a whole video with nothing at all happening. I mean, shiny Bastion, yeah, but you see, the thing is, <laughs> it was probably blurry when I was doing it. Because I didn't realize that it was trash quality at the time. 
Is it the light? <sighs> you know what? Let's let's spice things up. Let's spice things up a little bit. There you guys go. Hopefully I don't have to keep using codes to spice things up. But um Hey, if you guys watch this video, then those are all yours. If you, if you get a code, please let me know what you got in the comment section. That would be pretty awesome. So I like to hear from you guys. Here, other than, please, can you give me a code? Please. Please. Hey. Hey, boss. Hey, boss. Can I have uh, the code, please? Boss. You guys didn't know I was just trying to intimidate Filthy Frank, but I did a terrible job, so... Don't come at me, guys. Don't come at me. I'm tired. When, I, when I'm not tired, I'll be more willing and more capable of doing things. We better get a shiny soon. Because if we don't get a shiny soon, I'm going to cry. And the next time I do this, do you guys want to listen to the noise as well? Like, the video game itself? And not have the background music at all? Let me know, because... I'm doing this because I'm just taking a risk. But, um... Normally, I don't want to take risks very much. And it would be nice for you guys to hear the live shiny. And not get surprised. Because just hearing the sparkle, the shine from it, is so beautiful. Now certain things, I saw a shiny, like, I hope it, it wasn't it, but the shiny animation looks like a huge sticker from what it looked like. Which, let's just say I wasn't a big fan of, necessarily. I don't like the um, shiny... The, um, the shiny animation for Sun and Moon. I don't like the catching animation either. I don't like it at all. It's like a sticker gets appeared after you caught it. I don't understand it. I, the, the one I like the most is X and Y. I really like X and Y's shiny sprite, like the shiny animation. And I really like the capturing animation. I think having this right here is a bit better just because the, like the background music just because you don't hear the same thing over and over and over again like I'm hearing but you guys are also hearing my voice which maybe you guys don't like and if you guys don't like it then just just press the X button not the dislike button because that would make me cry I don't care about dislikes or likes it's nice to have likes, it boosts my ego, but in all honesty, I get dislikes. I think dislikes are kind of silly, because they're pointless. Just as long as I don't get any infinite warfare type of dislikes, then I'll be fine. I don't want to have a video where people dislike it just to dislike it. In all honesty, I think Infinite Warfare is probably... They, people are saying it's like Black Ops 3 2.0. Which, I like Black Ops 3. I mean, I'm going to like the remastered Modern Warfare better. But... I like Black Ops 3. It's going to take me, like... It's going to take a lot of, like... Skill for me to get back to memorizing how to move inside of it. Don't get me wrong, it... When I went back to watch, like, when I went 
back to um, Black Ops 3 after I came home for like a visit. I was like, what the heck is this? Like, how do I move? I could not move at all in that game for some reason. I sucked at it. I sucked at the game, legitimately. Because I couldn't do anything. But I, now that I'm back at Black Ops 2, I can play that game with ease. I really don't think we're going to make it to the Friend Safari. I would like to, but I don't think we'll be able to make it, guys. I don't even know if we're gonna be able to get the, um... Get the, um, whatchamacallit? The shiny from War Hunting in time. We're approaching, we're approaching the three hour mark. We'll have an hour after this. So we'll still have plenty of time? It's just, like, shocking to me that I haven't found the shiny. But yet again, I have, it's been a while since I've shiny hunted, so I don't remember time lengths anymore. But if I find the shiny nose pass, I'm gonna be very upset with myself. Because screw knows best. Screw knows best if you can get a yam yanma or how yanma. I keep saying yam yam. Is it yanma or yanma? Does it yan mega mega yan mega? That would be cool. Yeah, mega yan mega. I don't like the fact that they aren't bringing back mega. Like they aren't giving us new megas. I want new megas. I, I really did want new megas. That would be so cool. Because I thought Mega Evolution was probably one of the best features Pokemon has added to a newer game. I would definitely take having my Mega Pokemon over walking with my Pokemon. That's how much I really like Megas. I don't think there's a Mega I actually dislike. Let me like think of all the Mega Pokemon. I don't think there is one that I dislike. The Alolan forms are cool, but they don't give. I, they don't. They aren't Mega cool, in my opinion. I'm like, okay, cool. There's a um, Snow Fox version of Nine Tails and um, Vulpix. That's cool. But they don't have like a new Mega, like a Mega Meganium. I would like a Mega Meganium. Make it competitive. Because Megas, they made Pokemon usable. Certain Pokemon that weren't usable, they're usable now. Charizard was not usable. I'm not gonna lie. Charizard was pretty damn and terrible. But with Mega Charizard X and Y, it became usable. With um, Beedrill. Beedrill and Mawile became usable after their Mega Evolution. I mean, Mega Beedrill's not gonna take a hit, but you know, it's going to hit. This is gonna hit back hard. It, it's going to hit back first and hard, too. This is very fast and it's very powerful. Mega Slowbro. Slowbro was usable. Now it's. <laughs> I think. I think Slowbro is probably the best Mega. I'm not gonna lie. It's probably the best Mega. With access to the move Scald and Recovery, like. So my Slowbro it runs Calm Mind, Rest, Sleep Talk, and Scald. I think. I think. Because I have its defenses boosted all the way. Fog. Super powerful. I mean, of course, water absorb Pokemon are an issue. Pokemon that resist water type moves are an issue. But what if I burn the Pokemon? 
and it's okay. I have the defenses to back everything up. Calm Mind is going to back me up with the special defense. The defense on Slowbro is overpowered, and then with the burn, it becomes even more overpowered, so Calm Mind works perfectly with it. And then just a super powerful skull stab. It burns things that aren't fire, and if it's a fire type, it's dying anyway. <laughs> I think Mega Slowbro is the best Mega. I mean, you have Sableye. Sableye's good, but um, I don't think it's Mega Slowbro level. I, I definitely don't think it's Mega Slowbro level. Good. Like I said, we're nearing the three hour mark. It's getting late. It's almost three o'clock. That's a nose pass for her. This is why I kind of really want someone with me while I'm doing this, so that way I can constantly talk and I don't get bored. Because me getting bored would dishearten me from keep going with the filming, but I'm doing it for you guys. I'm doing it for you guys. Hope like nobody on this floor is getting annoyed by me. Because if they are, then oh well. People have been blasting their music, and what if what if that what if that annoyed me, huh? What if that really annoyed me? I mean, I didn't. I would never have told anybody, but you know. What? If, what if it did? Nothing happens. That, that's the answer, guys. I'm not a punk fan. I, I kind of like the music. My friends used to listen to that a lot. I just really want to get the shiny so that way I can wrap up this video because I know how long it's going to take and I'm going to be really upset if I don't get this shiny. I'm going to end this video as soon as we get the shiny from horde hunting. All you need for horde hunting is a sweet scent Pokemon and for it not to be raining inside Pokemon X and Y and no Mega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, it doesn't rain at all. You can also use honey, but who uses honey if they have free honey, technically? It's like free infinite honey. Instead of like pay 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 to win Chinese. <laughs> Poundor! None of them are blue. You know what would be the funniest thing? If it took all this time to get a shiny Houndor or something like that, and then I killed it. Don't they have Roar? Would that scare me away, technically? I hope it doesn't. I have sticky cup. I have sticky cup. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Yamas! I would really... I do want a shiny Yamas. But hey, we at least got one shiny, which is nice. Whether it's the worst, ugliest shiny, and I can't stand that Pokemon whatsoever, and I'm really upset that I got it. Even if it is that Pokemon, you know, we still got it. 
not my not my shiny dragoon that I wanted. I'm going to fight for endlessly. The thing I'm really scared about is that it's just gonna shine and it won't appear because it's blurry. I wonder how many videos in total I have. I can check that, right? It's not good to my about. Okay, it doesn't have how many videos I have. It doesn't tell me how many videos I have. Okay, that's interesting. I think I have over 400 videos? I know for sure I have over 400. But then again, there's also people who have like 10 videos and they have thousands upon thousands upon thousands of subscribers. But yet again, they also don't stream for 3 hours and 1 minute and 52 seconds. <laughs> And get only one shiny friggin' basculin. You don't know how, like, irritating that Pokemon is. I legitimately dislike that Pokemon. No, it'd be funny. If I started shiny hunting for a shiny mud pit, and softly setting for it, and got it before Kayla, that would crack up. I don't know if she likes me using her name. First name like that. But I I kinda wanna do that just just to see if I get it before her, because if I get it before her, I'm gonna feel so terrible. But it will be hysterical in a way. It's gonna take a lot of time though. And I would want to do it live, so I'd have to do it over a weekend like this, where I have nothing to do. Which is essentially every weekend I'm at college, because I have nothing to do. Because, like I said, I have no friends. The last time, like, like I said, the last time I physically talked to a person face to face was well over a week ago. Almost two weeks. I think it. I think it might be two weeks, and it's going on the third. <sighs> it's bad. I don't know. You guys die just like me. <laughs> but maybe I'm sighing because I don't have the stupid Pokemon that is shiny for me. Come on, I. I've been. I've been going at it for over three hours now. We can get pumped with this music. Once I get a shiny, I'm going to flip the freak out. I think, I don't think it's, for like a super duper long stream, like a sh long shiny race, yeah, I think it should be the first person to get all three shiny. That would be cool if me and that person have a lot of time. But I think that for most of them, it's going to be just best two out of three. But a shiny and each thing has to be made, it has to be caught.
But one day I'll catch that Dratini. I went through it with Carvana. I caught that Carvana. It's my Carvana now. <laughs> that was one of the funnier videos too. Oh my good lord. Just the reaction made me. That, that like made that video for me. The reaction. So it was probably one of the funniest reactions I've done. I made noises in which I, I will not repeat. I will not repeat those noises. Run like we've been doing for over an hour. It's approaching three o'clock right now. I have a lot to do. I have to go spam Injustice Mobile so that way I can get 600 credits. So that way I can go buy the sorcery pack to go get Raven. So that way I can go complete the Suicide Squad Harley Twin mission. And that's that's a peeve. That's a peeve of mine. I, it's peeving me off a little. There has to be some type of easier way to get credits, but, you know, I did not beat as... Excuse me. I did not beat as high of a level as I need. Like, I cannot make it to a certain level for some reason. Jesus. I don't think my roommate's coming back tonight. <laughs> I don't think my camcorder wants to, you know, be nice to me and focus. All of them are red, guys. All of them are red. Not a single one of them is that blue tint that I want. When I do shiny hunts, I either listen to music or um, watch videos of other people getting the shiny shiny that I'm hunting for. And then I try to race them to see if I can get the shiny before they can get the shiny inside their game. Even though, of course, you know, they technically got the shiny before me. But, like, before before the video where they encounter the shiny, I try to race them. Oh, Houndors. Haven't seen you in about an hour. I think I've said that already. I don't understand why I don't do the... In okay, I do understand why I don't do the international shiny hunting thing. I did it once, but I didn't catch a single shiny during that time period because I had health issues. Yeah, I just couldn't focus. But, um... I really... I don't like some of the rules they have. I really don't like some of the rules they have. Where is all full odds shinies or mm, yep, you, you ain't getting points at all. I feel as though you should make the rules so that way, for example, it's based off the percentage. The lowest percentage, like for example, if you use chain fishing, you'll get a point. You'll get like half a point, like a quarter of a point. And if you do full odds, then you'll get like 5 to 10 points instead of like having it varied like that. That would be so much cooler that you could use methods. People who can't shiny hunt like other people. And I can't, I don't want to restart my game because of the fact that I don't have, I have the shiny charm in here. I collected all the Pokemon. That's kind of the big thing I do for each generation. I collect all the Pokemon and then send Pokemon that I've collected from the previous generation 
Shoot that game. Oh my god, there's a shiny. I heard it. You guys can see it. Okay. Okay. We're going to turn that off. We're going to take out the deck. Okay. Here it is, guys. It's coming down to the final moment. So it's the one all the way to the left, I believe, right? Yeah, left, right? Trick for... Okay, so I, yeah, it's the one all the way to the left. So we're just going to start all the way to the right, then. And these things have 32. Some of them. Not that one. <laughs> I don't want my team gaining from it. Oh, so it's the fastest snow... <laughs> It's the fastest snow pass, guys. It's a block over here. I got the two worst shinies I could have. Uh uh. We ain't dealing with that defense rise. I'm just waiting for the one to have sturdy and make me get peeved off that I have to hit it twice. Oh, I can no longer escape. Oh, no. Look, I could, I could have escaped whenever I wanted. I have the I have the smoke ball. I can do whatever I want. And there's the sturdy. And this one's hard. And that one's hard too. Yeah, but you see the thing is you have one HP. I can I can kill you right now. But I'm gonna hit the this guy right here. And he has 30. Oh good lord, thank you guys for giving me some sturdy Pokemon to to hit. You're giving me some sturdy hard Pokemon to hit, if you know what I mean. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to see. If this one has sturdy on it, that would be nice. The shiny one. Oh, critical hit. Critical hit when it had one hit point left. Thank you, Malamar. You are the best. But yeah, guys, that was a live shiny, even though you didn't see it. I heard, I heard the sparkle. I heard the sparkle, which is why I, I said that. But you can see when it, it gets darker whenever the shiny appears. I believe, yeah, my Gardevoir has Trace on it. So if it has Sturdy, I can knock it down to one hit point and not even care. So guys, after 3 hours and 13 minutes, I've caught myself a shiny Pokemon that I've already caught before. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to just paralyze it just... Just for the giggles. Just for the giggles. Actually, probably not. See, look, that's the shiny. Okay, so it does have sturdy. Well, guess what? Oh, no, don't use tackle. Oh, man. Guess what? We're going to psychic you. Because you have sturdy. Watch it not have sturdy or something. And that would have made me so sad. <laughs> In all honesty, that would have made me really, really sad. Well, we can just bag it now. Let's see, what Pokeball do I want to use? Luxury Ball? Is that golden? Eh, ah, it's more black. Master Ball, of course. I, I want to use my Master Ball on it. I'm trying to think. Quick Ball. Or Premier Ball. Or an Ultra Ball. I could use an Ultra Ball. Ultra Ball wouldn't look nice. caught it well that's it guys um before we go um here you see that face collide that's yours don't tell your friends do we want to name this one yes just just because I'm gonna name him I'm gonna name her 
Jamie. Space. <laughs> Fox with two X's. So, um, we can save the game real quick because I know I didn't save it for the Basculin because, first of all, I don't even care about Basculin enough to save it. <laughs> But we can definitely show off this Probo, the, um, Nose Pass inside Pokemon Ami. Or, yeah, Pokemon Ami, I think it- no, is it Ami? I don't even know. It's beautiful. It's beautiful, I'm not gonna lie, it's a nice looking shiny. But, I don't want three. But yeah, it's a- where's his mouth? Okay, okay, thank you, thank you. Okay, it doesn't have a mouth, it's just eats through its nose. Smile! Smile! That's that's it smiley. <laughs> well, thank you guys for watching this video. If you enjoyed, well first of all let's show this off. Well, um normally there would be a second um there would be a second part to it where we just go and the thir there will be a third and final part where we go into a friend safari and catch a Pokemon there. It's just it's that it's getting close to four hours on this thing and it's getting very late and I do need to get some rest because I do plan to upload this video tonight. A low special attack, I'm good with that, and high special defense. Sturdy nature, I mean sturdy ability. High, what's the nature? It's, um, is it careful? Careful, I think. Yeah, look at me. I haven't been away from Pokemon, but I know my stuff. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please hit that thumbs up button down below. I plan to do more of this. If you guys want to be a part of this series and join me in a Skype call and then we race each other, I would definitely, definitely be happy with that. But um, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time with more Pokemon content. So until then, YouTube, goodbye.